Good morning, Broncos. Welcome back to Bronco News. I hope you're having an amazing Friday. And as y'all know, it is homecoming. So if you have any moms that need some first aid, be free to go down to the library with Miss Tobel. She will be fixing mums for us. She's gonna have everything you need, like staples, safety pins, hot glue, everything you're gonna need. Make sure to go during passing period or your lunch. Seniors, panoramic photos will be taken Monday morning, so make sure to be there for that. And our homecoming queen will be announced at tonight's game. So if you don't have your tickets yet, get your tickets online and bring your IDs. You will need those. And we have a couple people we wanna congratulate. We have Mikey Coda voted QB of the week for Division 6A by Dave, Dave Campbell, Texas Football. Also, Santiago Madrano, ABC's Big Two Athlete of the Week for the performance at LD Bell last week. And finally, Elijah Santante, our 2024 Homecoming King, voted, uh, nominated uh, by the Bronco Band, and he is our head drum major. So be free to stay after pledges. We will be showing a couple clips. We interviewed Coach Hartman, a couple football players, and Elijah himself. So have a good Friday. Stand for the pledges. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. Hey guys, welcome back to Bronco News. I'm Leslie Cervantes. I'm here interviewing our very own Coach Hartman for football. How are you? Doing great, how are you doing? I'm doing great. So I wanted to ask you a couple questions. So how's Bonfire so far? It's been great, it was a great turnout. A lot of people out here and you know, just enjoying the, the weather. You know, it's, the sun's kind of hot right now, but, it, but in the shade it's nice and it's, it's some nice weather. All right, what do you think your favorite part's gonna be um, here later on? Uh, I think it's going to be the band. I, I love listening to the band, band? and, and I, I love the, the drum circle, listen to yeah. that. But, you know, and uh, you know, of course the bonfire, you know, yeah. and seeing our guys around the bonfire and having fun. All right. So um, I did a little digging and I knew you went to school here, right? Is that yeah. correct? You're right. Yeah. All right. So when was this? When did you graduate? Graduated in 1993. All right. Can you give us like a little recap on uh, what's happened since then? Well, I graduated in 93, and uh, after graduating here, I went and played at Angelo State and okay. uh, played quarterback there for three years. And uh, after graduating there, I went and coached um, in Olney, and then, then I came back to Odessa, and then I left to Glen Rose, and Corsicana, and now back to here. Oh, wow. A pretty full life, isn't it? Okay. So um, I did a little more digging, and I found out that you were Mr. OHS back in the day. Is that true? That is true. That is true. I had pictures. Don't know where the phone's at, but I had pictures. I'll show you those later. Also, I knew that your junior year, you lighted a torch or something like that, your junior year. Can you elaborate on that? Yeah, we did. Uh, I, uh, in, the, um, in the pep rally uh, we had, we lit a torch and then... Uh, um, passed it along and and, um, and lit a sign on fire uh, for the Permian game. So uh, we don't do that no more. So can like you explain what it was like? What exactly it is? I mean, it's just uh, we we had some guys that we passed the torch along, and at the very end we had a um, uh, a paper thing that went up pretty quick, and so we were able to light it and you know turn off all the lights, and you know it's a lot of fun. All right. Well, I, those are all the questions I have for you today. I hope you enjoy your bonfire. Thank you. Appreciate it. Hey guys, so who are who am I here with today? Uh, Landon Wilkerson. All right, Landon, what is your position? I play DB. All right, so I wanted to ask you a couple questions. Um, how's Bonfire so far? Uh, pretty good. There's not a lot of people here yet. Um, what do you think your favorite part's gonna be? Lighting the fire. Lighting the fire? Yeah. All right, so y'all won against LD Bell last week. How do you feel about that? 
Uh, pretty good. It's a Dallas team, so it's always nice. Yeah, I heard they're pretty hard to be. What was it true? Is there are they hard? They were just big, really. Yeah. All right. So, um, what do you want to see in the next game? More of the same, just winning. All right. That's all. Hello. Who am I here with today? Dominic Taylor. What's your position? Uh, I play linebacker. Okay, so how was uh, last week's game with LD Bell? Uh, I feel like it was pretty good. Uh, what did do you have any mistakes that you want to correct for the next game? Um, I'm not too sure. You're not too sure? No. But are we gonna get that dub? Yes. Yeah. All right. Who are we playing this uh, this week? Um, El Paso. El Paso. Are you think you're gonna get that dub for reals? I think we are. All right. So, uh, how's Bonfire so far? It's pretty good. Pretty good? Okay, so what's your, uh, what are you excited for? Uh, excited for them to let the fire. All right, so who do you think is gonna win Homecoming King? Uh, Mikey Coda. Mikey Coda? Are you pretty strong about that? I'm pretty that, that's strong about it. All right, um, that's off. Hey guys, we're here with Elijah. So how are you feeling after last night? You know, it still hasn't hit me yet. I'm still super excited. Like, it doesn't feel real yet to me. Yeah, did you actively campaign? Yes, um, I don't know if you guys have seen, I have a few posters up around the school and I actually spent all the week, the weekend of, last weekend, I spent making little dumb dumb notes and it said, don't be a dumb dumb, vote for Elijah and Charlie. That, that's creative, I like that, I like that very much. So, like, how did it feel like, at the bonfire when they like shouted your name, like, how did it feel? Um, I can tell you my first thoughts was like, this is not happening, like this is not real. I don't know if you guys saw, I was shaking really bad. Like I was like nervous. I was just full of like so many different emotions. Most of it, it was happiness. I was excited, you know? Yeah, and how did it feel like when your teammates from band like, like cheered you on? That was the best feeling, yeah. you know? I know band and showgirls, they have, like I have their support and that that just made me feel so happy hearing them cheer for me. You had my support too. Yes. I, I was shouting. I was like, yeah, <laughs> Kogila, yeah. But um, so how does, how are you gonna spend your time being Hoko King? You know, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna be more um, outgoing, you know, okay. just ride this wave of excitement. Yeah. And I'm, I'm proud of you. We're all proud of you. Thank you. Round of applause, round of applause, yes. Okay, that's it. Bye.